Welcome to the introductory video for the video series Control Shift Enter Mastering Excel Array Formulas. Hey, uh, this is an introductory video, and then we'll go on to uh, the 24 videos. I just want to go through a few things here. There's this um, workbook, which comes on the DVD and also is available for download. I want to go through the topic sheet because there's t about 24 videos, and there's a lot of topics in each video. And actually, I'm just starting to shoot the video. So some of this will change by the time I'm done. But when you get this workbook and you're watching the video, you can actually use this sheet as a hyperlink. So if you're on uh, video number 9 here on some, some product function, you can click on this. This is a link, and it will jump right to that sheet, right to cell A1. At the top of each one of these sheets, these numbered video sheets, is a hot link to go back to the topic sheet. Not only that, but if you want to go look at a particular topic within a video, these uh, blue links here jump to that section. So this will jump to example 6 in video 9 if I click right here. Now it's always going to jump to the bottom here. You can scroll down, but there it is. I'm going to use Control Home because the link back to the topic sheets is going to be at the top in cell A1. Um, so the topic sheet will help you navigate through this large workbook with lots of examples. Now, in some of the later videos, since we're talking about array formulas, sometimes they can get pretty huge, the formulas themselves, with lots of cell references. And so examining which formulas um, are best to reduce calculation time, I've done a bunch of timing. So this is just a list of the videos. The, the examples in the videos, and then the name of the workbook where we did the timing. Now, I didn't want to load this workbook up, this array formula DVD book start.xlsm, with a bunch of you know 50,000 rows of data. So if we, uh, when you look through the files for downloading, there'll be a, uh, or on the DVD, there'll be a timing formulas folder, and within that will be a bunch of workbooks with uh, the 10,000 or 50,000 rows uh, of data with the formulas and the timing results. And we'll talk about that later in, as the video goes on. Now, this is a video about array formulas. You know, most people don't use a formula. It's an obscure little part of what Excel can do. And uh, you know, I'm not the smartest guy in the world about Excel at all. In fact, I'm not really that smart of a guy. I just have tried to collect together some of the things I've seen over the years and put it in a kind of logical order. So if you want to learn about array formulas, the, the elements, the basics of how you construct array formulas and what kind of things you want to think about when making array formulas, that's what this video is uh, all about. Now. Uh, I'm going to go over to the sheet thanks, because basically everything you're going to see in this video came from somebody else, some Excel master who really is, uh, or these people really are Excel masters. I'm kind of just taking little bits and pieces and trying to put them in a logical order. Now, from the Mr. Excel message board and YouTube, I've learned a lot of things from a lot of people. Now, Excel, Mr. Excel message board. I've posted here many times over the years, and I've tried to compile a list of all the people who have helped me over the years. Now, I just want to mention a, a couple people here. Aladdin, of course, a lot of people say it's it all starts with Aladdin, but he has helped me out so much over the years. Andrew Paulson, uh, it's it's as if he is uh, instant texting. Sometimes you you post a question, and he just immediately comes back with a great answer. Barry Houdini, the master for me, what I've learned from him is the, is the mastery of date formulas. And then of course there's Mr. Excel, Bill Jellin. He's the guy who started it all, it all. He's the guy who started the Mr. Excel message board. And certainly the first books I've ever read by him are the ones that got me started in Excel. And certainly Mr. Excel giving me the chance to do dueling videos with him. Charles Fast Williams, um, and we'll talk about his website later when we're doing timing. He is the master of reducing calculation time, uh, and I've learned a lot from him. Circle Chicken, both at YouTube and at Mr. Excel Message Born, learned a lot. Colin Legg, some amazing solutions he's helped me with. Dave Patton, 
some uh, complicated formulas he had helped me with. Dominique, the first guy who ever answered a question I posted at the Mr. Excel message board. Just amazingly kind and helpful throughout the years. Don Quixote helped me with some really complicated formulas, including reverse two-way lookup. Hot Pepper, amazing formulas he's helped me with. Jeffrey Brown, some great solutions, uh, uh, not just formulas, but other solutions. John Von Der Hayden, I'm sure I'm not pronouncing some of these names correctly. He's helped me out immensely over the years. Marcello uh, helped me uh, learn some things about formulas. Nori, one of the original guys in the very first posts I ever made, helped me. Then there's Peter S.S. Uh, S. and Vogue. These two guys are amazing. They it's as if they're always online and anytime you ask a question they're instantly there to help you and uh, give you an answer. Uh, PGC01 has helped me with some unbelievably cool statistical questions, amazing solutions. Richard Scholar, always there um, uh, with some amazing solutions, some t a couple uh, extracting sorting uh, formulas that have really helped. Rod I don't know how to pronounce his name, Cartier, helped me with some great formulas over the years. Smitty with some uh, amazing help, uh, not just for formulas, but other things over the years. T. Volco, absolutely some amazing solutions. Uh, Tom Yurtis, if I'm pronouncing that right, he's, he's one of the first guys who ever answered one of my posts at the Mr. Excel message board. And same with, if I'm not pronouncing it right, uh, uh, I don't even know how to pronounce it, but he's also one of the first ones to ever help me, as was Yogi. Just amazing, and the list goes on and on. Also at YouTube, uh, all these guys have uh, helped. I post a solution, and sometimes they come up with really cool comments or other uh, more efficient uh, solutions. So really, I'm just kind of compiling in this video all the things that I've learned from all these people. All right, uh, so that's a little bit about the introduction here. In our next video, we'll actually have uh, 15 important examples of formula basics, and then we'll jump into uh, what are array formulas. All right, see you next video.